prosecution would make such a move? Or are you thinking of a career change to defense? She's guilty, I know. <laughs> I appreciate the concern, Your Honor. I will stand by my statement, however, regardless of how the court sees my role here. <laughs> now, Miss Vasquez, do you have an explanation? I can't believe Edgeworth is help for me, senpai! <laughs> <laughs> the prosecution isn't good who's who in the defense. What kind of court is this? No matter. I think you misunderstood me. I had a perfectly good reason to believe there would be no rehearsal. Hmm. Very well. The witness will change her testimony to reflect this reason. You you can read these parts. Are you yeah, sure this, screen? This yeah. is a new statement. These are new. Oh. I knew that Hammer was injured and couldn't do any action scenes, so I left them behind. Is there gonna be more if we go next or is... no? Okay, this press is just one. Oh, they. How did you know about the injury? How, how did I know? Sal, he told me. Sal, the director. Hmm. You had to find something to peg this on her here, or everything's done till now and it's all wasted. I believe in you, Nick. Go get him. Thank you, Maya. I really could use Mia, though. Shit. I was with Sal and old bags, cured lady, found That's body. Old, yeah. Fuck you. <laughs> uh, how about... Let's go for the assistant here, maybe? So let's try... Mm -hmm. The assistant was there too, only powers of absence, so press that. Oh, that... Mr. Powders was taking a nap, correct? So he says. Did no one go to call him? Remember. Remember... What? The 5th of November. There was a dead body lying in front of us. You expect me to be calm? You certainly seem calm enough when I accuse you of murder. <sighs> Press harder. Wait a second! Wouldn't that be the other way around? The other way around? <laughs> you discovered a murdered body and one person was missing, Cha! Wouldn't you normally go looking for the missing person? Uh. I have to agree with the defense on this one. Well, Miss Vasquez. Mm. Logically speaking, perhaps. But no one there was thinking very logically, and I assure you. Also, without his steel samurai costume, Powers doesn't really stand out. We often left him on the bus when he's shooting at location. No one noticed he was missing. Poor Pooters. Mm. Well, I suppose that explains that. Very well, Miss Fastquest, you may continue. What a bitch. I'll give, I'm gonna give you a hint. What's up? The, the new statement, we have to do something, we have to present something there. Okay, so, Scary Lady will back. back. I asked to be left out of the proceedings. I went back to the trailer to get the stuff. I knew the Hammers was injured and couldn't do any action, so I left them behind. Alright, so we gotta present something, let me look what we got. What do we got? Uh, hmm. Give her the van. <laughs> <laughs> Wait. Hmm? Wasn't the path blocked? It was, but was that during that time? I'm my times are getting mixed up. They took their break at what, 2.30 and last 2.45? Yeah, when did the um the thing fall down? Do you remember? 2.15. It happened apparently blocked path to the scene of the crime between 2.15 and 4 o'clock, so it could have been after the, they did their break. Okay. So... This is tough. Why are you so tough? <laughs> this is her going to Studio One, right? Mm hmm. Like, 
she's going to Studio One, leaving Studio Two. Right. He says she knew that Hammer was injured because Sal told her, but there was something else that was more, mm, more evidence than that he was injured. Oh, wait, no, never mind. What are we thinking? Well, I mean, how would Sal have known that if he was eating steak with her, or was that True. earlier? So she's probably lying. What other evidence could she have used to know that Hammer was injured? The photo. You think the photo? No. Not the... <laughs> the old photo, the... Not the five-year-old one, the... One yeah. of him limping. Yeah, that, that was the first photo we ever got. Huh. Fuck. Do we want to present this photo then? Yeah, it's her contradiction. Alright, present Powers' photo. Whew. OBJECTION! You knew that Hammer was injured. Don't you think that's a little funny? I mean, it was the Steel Samurai who was injured. It was Will Pooters! <laughs> Mr. Rod, explain yourself. Yeah, Mr. Hammer is dragging his leg in this photo. But that's because he was pretending to be Mr. Pooters! <laughs> uh, pretending? One person was injured in the run through that morning. That person was Mr. Pooters, not Mr. Hoomer. Now, why did you think it was Mr. Hoomer who was injured? <laughs> I, 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 I already saw what Sal told me. That, that's right, he must have gotten it wrong. I I'm think not. Mr. Manella was at the run through that morning. He would have known it was Mr. Pooters who was injured. He saw it happen. He, why would, why would he tell you the wrong person? <laughs> Miss Vasquez! You saw Hammer limping? E. You saw Hammer <laughs> limping! Actually, you didn't hear anything from Mr. Manella. You saw Mr. Hammer limping with your own eyes. Yes, but wasn't it Mr. Pooters who was injured? Yeah, but remember. Mr. Hammer was dragging his leg, too. He was pretending to be Mr. Pooters. Ah. And when was he doing this? Well, it would have been after he put on the Steel Samurai costume and went to Studio 2, where he was murdered. Exactly. Thanks, buddy. Miss Vasquez, you met him, didn't you? You saw the Steel Samurai limping! And Mr. Hammer was in that Steel Samurai suit. Cause she wanted to kill Pooters. Yeah. That's why you were confused! That's why you thought it was Mr. Hammer who had been injured that morning! <laughs> oh my god! Order. Order. I will have an order of... Fries. Witness, get the judge some fries. Can you refute this claim? <laughs> got a tummy one, ache? One Ooh. thing I'm confused about is why Hammer pretended to be powder, uh, pooters. It's coming up. Okay. Well, Very well. well I, what I think is because uh, remember he kind of like was a star, and now Will Powers was the star, being the Steel Samurai. Uh huh. He wanted to be the star again. Wanted to be the Steel Samurai. Weird. That makes sense. Well, yeah. Let's Hi. see. Sneak it. Hey. Shut up, Vasquez! I'm not done. Shut up, Vasquez! You bitch! <laughs> bitch! 
I'm guilty. I know. Yeah, <laughs> let's see you sneak out of this one fast, guys. All right, my line. Hey, Will, I have a question for you. Eric, why are the real killers always so persistent? Why the world blow up Mr. Armored Dead? Yes, he'd fallen on hard times, but he was a star. I had nothing to gain from his death. <laughs> <laughs> Christ. <clears throat> yes, she would need a motive. Why would she have killed the victim? If there is a reason, it is unclear to this court. Does the defense have anything to say on the matter? In other words, can you prove she had a motive? Uh, I personally have no fucking idea as to why look, she would have. Look at your evidence. Mm. I have no idea. Yeah, why would she have done it? There's, I don't see why. He's a bitch. Yeah, that's, that's the only got. real reason. Yeah, <laughs> it's like you're a bitch. Submit that as evidence. Yeah, it's like the word bitch on a piece of paper. What about the photo? The one we got before. The old one. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I mean, don't you think if a man was being blackmailed, he'd go crazy at one point? For five years. Of course you can prove it. Well, I mean, yeah, like he could get crazy, it. but I'm just trying to think of like why she would kill Pooters though. Or maybe he was just like, hey best quiz, I'm Pooters. <laughs> Check it out. And she was like, fuck this. You're crazy. crazy, get out of here. Yeah, it's <laughs> probably something like that, maybe. She didn't kill Pooters, she killed Hammer. Yep. Oh, right, 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 right. But, like, he was pretending to be Pooters. Like, he has, like, an identity crisis disorder or some shit. <laughs> okay, who started the Pooter and Hoomer thing, by the way? That would be Cry, usually. <laughs> Hoomer was MC Hammer for a while, too. Yeah, I'm... Yeah, he was. Alright, I'm just gonna... I'm just gonna say, yeah, we have evidence. So okay. We, of course I can prove it. Even though you don't really know. <laughs> right, we usually do this. Okay. I have proof. And I'll show it to you. I present to the court evidence as to Miss Vasquez's motive in the murder. And I'm gonna use that really old five year photo. Right. And I hope it doesn't fuck us up. Oh, not. <sighs> present five year old photo. Take that! This is my proof. This is the photo from. Oh, that's oh Judge. Oh. Sorry. Sorry. This is. The photo from before. <clears throat> this photo reveals the motive in this murder. <clears throat> I'm right, aren't I, Miss Vasquez? Her. Oh, wait, shit. <clears throat> Five years ago, Mr. Hoomer was at the height of his fame. With D. Vasquez's help, a terrible accident was swept under the carpet. Ladies and gentlemen, the case currently up for trial. It began on that day, five years ago. Mm -hmm. On that day, five years ago. <laughs> Ironically enough, the accident precipitated Mr. Hoomer's fall. His fall from stardom. His guilt weighed on him, weighed him down, no doubt. However, you, D. Vasquez, used Mr. Hoomer. You made him work for you for petty change. Like the tool he was. <laughs> Bringing us to the present day, and Mr. Hammer's last role as the evil magistrate. Yeah, wait, yes! Undoubtedly, it was a constant source of shame for the X-Star. <laughs> One moment, Mr. Frat. We are talking about motives here, yet you have only talked about Mr. Hammer or Hoomer. It almost seems as if... As if it was Mr. <laughs> Hoomer who had not killed... Oh, motherfucker, something killed. changed me. I'm sorry. I'm out. What? 
What? We got confused a little bit, I think. Yeah, it changed her face, and I got confused. I see. <laughs> <laughs> As if Mr. Hoomer... Wait, what? I know. Oh, Mr. Hoomer is Steve Vasquez! He's cross-dressing! <laughs> I knew it! <laughs> His greatest role yet. <laughs> he is on par with Meryl Streep and Gary Oldman. <laughs> As if it was Mr. Hoomer who had killed the Vasquez, not the other way around. What motive would Miss Vasquez have? Yes, that's right. Uh, according to what you say, I would have had no reason to kill Hammer. He was a good source of income for me. And I never get rid of useful men. I'm a slut. It's a policy of mine. Mr. Fright, please explain Miss Vasquez's motive for murder. Fuck. Fuck. Damn it. The photo was all I had. This is true. She didn't even have that. Yeah. <laughs> Fuck. Present my attorney's badge. I'm mm -hmm. an official. Damn it. I'm not quite sure. Like. Wait a minute. What? So after all Wait of this, minute. Cody's testimony. Uh huh. Cody took a picture on his camera, did he not? Right. Of he did. that final fight. Right. Of his death with the spear. He erased it because he had lost. Oh, right. That was mm -hmm. something completely different. Oh. Fuck. Was it? I thought that was related directly to the murder. No, 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 no. It, w it was really directly to the murder, but if we're going off of what happened with the whole fence thing, isn't that something completely different from what Cody saw? Yes. Kind of is, isn't it? Yeah. Like, incredibly different. Shit. So, that means, remember, I, that means she probably didn't kill him then, so she doesn't have a motive. She doesn't have a motive? Mm -mm. So she had no motive. Nah. Well then, fuck. It just is fucked awkward. the past thirty minutes. She had no motive, <laughs> Your Honor. She had no motive, Your Honor. What's that now? It was Mr. Hammer who was after blood. All Miss Vasquez did was push him off the stairs. In self-defense. What's that now? Ugh. It's simple, sideways comments. Mr. Hammer was intending to kill Miss Vasquez! Whoa! What? What? Rubble, 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 rubble. Your Honor! Jack Hammer drugged Mr. Pooters with sleep belts. Jack Hammer snuck into the dress room and stole a Steel Samurai costume. Bastard. Jack Hammer wore the costume to fool the security lady and to think it was powers. Oh, so he was trying to frame powers, but then he died Ye in the process. Yep. <laughs> oh. God, this makes so much more sense now. Then Jack Hammer made his way to the trailer. And for what purpose, you ask? To kill D. Vasquez, who had so cruelly taken advantage of him for all those years. Get out of my fucking cigarette! <laughs> <laughs> so, you did do it, didn't you? I am now very calm without my cigarette, yes. <laughs> That's usually how it goes, you're supposed to be more calm with them. It was me. I'm out of cocaine. <laughs> um, I'm gonna call an ambulance! There's a blood everywhere! Too late! Ah! Miss Vasquez! What? What happened here? Manual fell from the stair trailer stairs! Manual! Manual! 
Please, 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 please try to make up. <laughs> no, no, how could you? It was an accident. It's just, yeah, we was doing an accident scene, and. No, man, I'm mad at Don't touch your bitch ass kids. <laughs> please, please don't die. Oh, she just lost. Whoa, my God. Mr. Edgeworth, where's D. Vasquez? In the waiting lobby, Your Honor. As calm and collected as ever. I see. Mr. Fry. Yeah, what it is, man. It appears you have brought about yet another miracle. <laughs> Thank you. I think not, Your Honor. Will Poors is it was innocent. That he should be found so is only natural, not a miracle. Yes, yes, you're right. Very well. This court finds the defendant, Mr. Will Pooters, not guilty. Oh yeah! yeah. Everybody make a mess. Woohoo! Paper. <laughs> that is all. This court is now adjourned. Oh shit. October 20th, 1 12 p.m. District Court, Defendant Lobby number three. I don't, I don't know what to say. Thank you so much. <laughs> I'm just glad you're okay there, Harry, buddy. Yeah, but it's, it's, it's sad. I know now that Mr. Amherst stole my costume. It's bad enough that he wanted to kill Miss Vasquez. But to think that he tried to free me for the murder. It makes me sad. Tell me why, Mr. Brett. Huh? 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 Tell me. Why did Mr. Amherst want to blame me? Uh, I feel like can we can. Can I say this a little more? I, f I feel like we can give him some closure. We can. Ah, uh, shit. Shit. Can we give him the path to glory? Yeah. Yeah! 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 Alright, show evidence. Well, this is what I think. Mr. Hammer wanted to put the blame on you because... Path to glory. Take that! Take that! Take that! <laughs> it's because you were the Steel Samurai. Because I was the Steel Samurai? Mr. Hammer was a big star. Once. But he was reduced to acting in a kid show, and as a villain, to boot. The kids friggin' love the Steel Samurai, and so, he hated you. Fucking haters. Yeah. I think I understand. Turn up. He could have just told me. I would have changed places with him any time. I think you're missing the point here. <laughs> So am I. So am I. Congratulations, Wei like Pei! Like... What does he look like? He looks like the, uh... The, uh, the, the dude from the new Pokemon game. The Team Flare leader. <laughs> He's got I... the same hair. Lys Lysander or whatever. Yeah, okay, I know guys, what you're going. About. Congratulations, oh. Wei Pei! Oh. Oh. Hey, wait, shit. <laughs> Thanks to you, I'll be able to don the Steel Samurai outfit once more. I can't wait to get back into that sweaty costume and... Oh... <laughs> oh, no... <laughs> Something wrong? <laughs> no, of course not. <laughs> Nick! Edward! <laughs> Say something, right? I'm not good with small talk. Huh? What? Oh. Um, that was too bad, Edgeworth! You don't waste any time gloating, do you? No, I really want to thank you. Vasquez would have gone away if you hadn't stepped in.
Wait. Wait, isn't Cutter's dead? No. Who? Hammer's dead. Hammer's dead. Oh, okay, okay. I was confused. Okay. Ah, oh, please meet you on powers. <laughs> uh, I'm Edgeworth. I'm a big fan of your work, Mr. Pudis. What? Liar. <laughs> right. I must say, I hadn't expected you to meet you again after all these years. Meet again.